Hey everyone, what's going down? Um, you know, I'm about to set up my Jackery or our Jackery solar power system today. We've been using Jackery since we've been out here on the homestead full time, but even part time way back going to 2019. Uh, but since we've been here since 2021, that's our main source of power. So shout out to Jackery. Uh, they're a great company. Anytime we need parts replaced like solar panels or anything, they're more than willing to work with you. Let me just adjust the camera just a little bit. So y'all about to see how we generally set up uh, to get solar power. It's a really sunny day out here. Um, we do have a backup uh, gas power generator just in case we get like a string of rainy days and we can plug them up to that. But they're great. We've had our first one we bought was a 240 watt back uh, a couple years back or a few years back actually. And uh, it's still going strong. So check out the setup. It's real simple. Highly recommend the 100 watt panels. Uh, we have a thousand watt battery. Um, these are on windy days. I'll put them behind the straps here just to make sure that our panels don't blow over. But um, 100 watt panels for any really size jack where you want will get the job done. Our thousand watt one requires two, but this 500 right here, go ahead and show you that real quick. This is a uh, the second we have in our wheelhouse, we have a 1,000, a 500, a 300, a 240 watt, and 160 watt. Very happy with them. Looking forward to expanding to a 1,500 watt and a 2,000 watt in the near future. Okay, great. This one's at 41% and it's getting 79 watts of input quite a bit which means that even though it's late in the day usually we get this out much earlier we may get a fair amount of sun Matter of fact, this 500, I'll probably move it over here because the sun right now is heading west. So to get most of the western sunlight, I think we'll move the 500 over here and leave the 240 and the 160 on this side.
see. So right now our jackeries are set up. As you can see, I got the 500, the 240, and the 160 set up here. They should charge today. It's a really bright, sunny day, and thankfully it's March now, so we're getting like longer days. It's not getting dark until like 7, 7.30. That makes a ton of difference out here. Uh, we definitely want a more established solar system for future use. We'd like to get a freezer, so that way when we start hunting and processing meat down the road, we can freeze it. So we'll need a much more substantial system. Uh, but right now, this works great for our 12 volt fridge and for our laptops and for our cell phones. So, you know, we have the thousand right now, which is on the uh, refrigerator. And we have another uh, 300 down there. All right. Okay, so these jackeries here, this 500 is at about 74%. We started late in the day, like around 1 o'clock today, probably about 4.30. Alright, I'm getting the... Let's check it out. Remove it a third time. 80%. 80% from what was it, 40 something? Uh, yeah, like 40. We put it out like at 1, 1.30. Like I said, we'd eventually like to get the 1500 and the 2000, uh, cause that would just give us more substantial uh, power. But eventually we want to get a more stationary setup system where we can have all the wattage we need, powerful inverter. And that way we can run pretty much all our power here on the homestead. Thank you for checking out this video. Definitely support Jackery and what they're doing and uh, continue to follow the journey of off-gridish homestead. Oneness.